you know, we mentioned yesterday, Craig, mm -hmm. at the U.S. Open of Surfing down in Huntington Beach, they're having extra patrols out. Right. Just keeping an eye on yeah. our shark friends. It's been a pretty uh, active season mm -hmm. for those uh, shark friends of ours. Yes. <laughs> up and down the entire coast. Yeah. Yeah, and it looks like uh, with surf up, warmer temperatures, a lot of people head into the beach. So mm -hmm. I'm always watching the lifeguards, right? Yeah. <laughs> We're sky nine up above. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Good morning to you. Uh, nice shot. Santa Monica. Gorgeous. And a little gray out there, Serene. Yeah. A little bit. Yeah, and you can feel it, right? It's a little humid today. Mm -hmm. So if you haven't stepped outside this morning, maybe you're still inside. When you step outside, you'll notice the difference with uh, the humidity coming up in warmer conditions. All right, so as we go through this afternoon, temperatures are similar to what we did yesterday. However, the humidity is back. Chance for showers and thunderstorms also in the forecast. We're looking now over Ventura Port District. Uh, you can see some of the waves coming on in. Beautiful start to the morning out there. A little cool and rather cloudy. It'll take some time to uh, clear from the clouds. Camarillo this morning. 68. Uh, if you're headed out to Taste of Camarillo later today, that's put on by Meadowlark Service League, and it looks like it's a nice afternoon. A little sea breeze coming through for most of the afternoon, but overall a great fun event. 60s and 70s right now, 69 in Santa Ana, 66 in Riverside, Big Bear at 52, and uh, we have that beach hazard statement in place you heard Joy talking about earlier, sets close to 7 feet, and a lot of the energy coming from a couple of storms down to the south. Hillary and Irwin. And Irwin's actually the stronger system right now. Yesterday was Hillary. We were expecting Hillary to kind of absorb Irwin. They're kind of, Hillary's going into the colder waters. You need good water, about 82 degrees or so for these to fuel these storms. Anyhow, what is going to happen is these two continue to travel and get closer together and merge close together. The energy just keeps coming our direction in the water. So we've got those high uh, waves coming on in, especially for the south facing beaches. Now we've got monsoon moisture creeping our direction as well. And it looks like it's going to sit close to us this entire week. Week, so it's going to warm up. You factor in the humidity. It's going to be a very sticky, uncomfortable week for us, especially with temperatures closer to 100 by the end of the week in some of the warmer spots. Headed out to the Dodgers today. Another round with the uh, Giants, about 84 degrees or so with a light breeze out of the west southwest at 3 to 7 miles per hour. Highs in the 90s today. Low to mid 90s and a couple of 80s for the upper 80s for the San Gabriel Valley and a couple of low 90s for the San Fernando Valley. 70s along the coast. Here's my seven-day forecast. More humidity and the chance for scattered showers and thunderstorms, perhaps for the valleys uh, into the IE and the high deserts and the mountains later this afternoon. And we will all have that chance Tuesday, serene, and through Wednesday and Thursday. And right now we'll take a look at sports. Here,